A vote for Rick Perry is a vote for all things merry. It's a vote for the very wind makes eagles soar. The thing you gotta know about Rick is he talks real loud, carries a smaller stick. Look out, America, Rick Perry's going on tour. A vote for Miss Bachman is a vote for the bands on the Cockman. And yes, by that, I mean the men so very gay. You know when she's caught your eye, cause she's looking at a different camera guy, but that's just the tea party way. And a vote for Dr. Paul is a vote that'll make you ball, cause you'll feel like you just threw out that very vote. But believe you me, it's all okay, cause Dr. Paul is here to say, even if all he knows how to play is just one note. A vote for Herman Cain is a vote for a man with brains, who will support those at the very top of the world. He wears the flag like a fancy suit, stomps the constitution with his boots, and making many, many people hurl. A vote for Rick Santorum is a vote for the fine decorum, cause if you're a minority, he's definitely on your side. There are all those other guys whose own words are their demise, and you can Google Santorum to justify all his pride. A vote for Romney come amidst is a vote that you'll then have to admit, corporations are just as much human as you are. But you know how those Mormons get ride bikes, ask, are you saved yet? But luckily for you, this one is a scar. Well, in the GOP, there's nothing for you and me except being free like a pot of peas and just several hints of hypocrisy. So come and join our show, then you will truly know just how we flow. Towards us, we owe the following things. Big donations, big celebrations, big nomination for this great nation.